Hi, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lindsay and I love to make Target Shot With Me's. So if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button below. Today, I'll be showing you the Hearth and Hands Spring Collection and I'm so excited to dive in and get started. I will say I will list as much as I can down below as far as links so that you can purchase. However, they won't be available until December 26th, which is the release day. I'm gonna start with this watering can. I think it's really cute. I love the color of it, how it has that green greenish teal color and then I also really love these picks for flower pots so if you have a flower that needs to grow like if it's a vine it needs to grow on something that's what you can use these for I'm pretty sure the spring collection last year had these little bud vases but I wanted to show them again and then they also had these really pretty almost like a charcoal look bud vase so I thought that they were priced very well for as heavy and well made that they are I also really love these wired baskets that they have for the spring I feel like you could put magazines in them you could do so much with it but they definitely have them out this year and they have a bunch of different vases and plants and stems so I'm about to show you all of it um, I do think some of the stems are priced a little high and same with the little vases if it's like very little and you know as far as a vase or a stem I feel like it shouldn't be too too much um, so I just wanted to point that out there I did find some of them to be a little bit on the pricey side I really love these tabletop decors that they have um, my favorite being the ones all the way on the right I just love the vase you'll see it in a second it's like a cream color and it has those little ridges around it I think it's really pretty so this one here is my absolute favorite I am so, so obsessed with these large faux plants. I think they would look great in any corner of any living room, to be honest. Um, it has the pretend dirt at the bottom, and then they just had this plant and a second one on the right that I'm going to show you momentarily, but I thought they were really, really pretty. And I love how this plant here on the right is like in its natural state with like the little holes in it. I love how that is like the look this year that I'm seeing is how you just see like plants in like their natural state that you typically would so I wanted to point that out but yeah I was really impressed with these planters and then how cute is this snack tray I think it's so neat for like hosting um, a party if you're gonna have Easter at your house or even just like if you have kids and you just want to put like nuts and and stuff in there I think it would make a great tray a snack tray also here is a little trinket dish I think this is great to put like your rings in or jewelry um, in your bathroom I thought that was really pretty and would also make a great Easter gift or Valentine's Day gift and then I also found this little wall hook you could use it to hang jackets backpacks coats keys you name it um, for $12.99 I thought it was a pretty good price and then I found this little canister that I thought was really pretty you could put sugar flour in it you name it and then I am just gonna go through and show you a bunch of other kitchen essentials that I thought were really pretty no one knows the reason we're both getting out of line mm -mm. now say goodbye and try to move on i'll get over you only wish that i knew how to go on
I'm not sure if you can tell by the looks of this video, but this Lazy Susan was enormous. It was really, really big. So if you're looking for a large one, it's 18 inches as you can see here. I would definitely recommend it. And pardon me for showing the prices underneath each of these. All of these items were extremely heavy, so they're like very well made. Um, I tried my best to do it with one hand, but I will have to say they were super, super heavy. I feel as if Hearth and Hand went with very neutral tones for this spring. They used a lot of grays, so you don't see many like pinks, yellows. Um, they kept it very neutral, so this type of stuff you could use year round. Here is a utensil holder. I think this one's really, really pretty, and it also has that Studio McGee look to it. And then I think this spoon holder is really cute too. I will say it was super, super light, so it's not heavy just to put things into perspective for you. This is an oversized tray and I can tell you it is extremely oversized. <laughs> so by giving them that name, I think was very appropriate and fitting. These decorative bowls also had that Studio McGee look to them. Um, they did have a medium sized one and a small sized one. I think it would be really pretty to put like fruits um, inside on your kitchen countertop or something like that. Or you can even put spheres and put it um, like on a coffee table. And then they also had these measuring cups. Again, I think it would make a great gift if you're looking to give somebody something for Easter or Valentine's Day. I just love the neutral tones of it. And then they also have these new spatulas as well. This cast iron is a little bit smaller than what I've seen on the internet. I feel like the internet makes it look much bigger, but I will say it is very, very heavy. This thing is extremely heavy, so if you're looking for a well-made cast iron, I would go with this. Also, I love this little bathroom holder. You can put like your curling irons in it or your brushes and then just like a few things um, on the side so it's like a nice tray. And then I also love this dirty and clean sign. You could use it for dishes, you could use it for a laundry room, it's up to you. And then these are little biscuit cutters. Again, you could put, make them as a gift and put like a basket together for somebody. Um, I love this little serving tray. I like how it's wooden, it's just super pretty and it just you know has that chic look to it and then here are some more gray tones a lighter gray as far as dishes and plates so i wanted to show you those as well If you're trying to get away from a tray that's wooden, they also have a basket woven one as well, so you could go for that look. If that's something you're looking for, they have both options there. And then I wanna show you the reusable napkins that they have. They have a plain white, and then they have this bluish grayish color also. In addition, they had this folding chair. Um, it only comes in green from what I can tell, but I think it's great, easy to transfer. It folds up very easily. Um, I just popped it in and out of the shelf, no problem. I just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow old. Moving along to the section full of scents, I am going to show you all the candles, sprays, you name it that they have for the spring. These right here, they didn't have labeled, um, but I tried to show as much as I could with what the scent was for each candle. And I just like some of the designs on the outside. I think they're really pretty and would go with most decor in someone's house. Back at me. I don't know what happened. 
These vases were sitting next to the candles and I just love the sandy look of it. These were like one of my favorite vases that I came across in this section. And then moving back to the candles, they did have um, like a set of four and also a set of three. So again, you can give the whole thing as a gift or you can keep them for yourself or you can divide them up and give them to four different people. So just to keep some ideas in mind, they also have the I love you candles. I believe they had them last year too. So great gift for Valentine's Day. I think you could give that to anybody. I am so, so excited to show you all these faux plants in this section. It just is a great transition into spring. There's not like floral in it, so it's just greenery. Very, very pretty. I will show you the tag for each. That way you know what the plant is, and then I'll show the price on the back. But enjoy. I think they're really pretty, and they're like all my favorite. I can't pick one that I love because I love all of them. <laughs> I was highly considering getting this four pack of cereal bowls for $19.99. I am going to sleep on it, think about it, but I really like them a lot. Here is a rectangular tray. It is oversized, um, super pretty, and it's very comparable to the round one, except it's rectangular. And then here are the throw pillows that they have. They are each $19.99. And again, Hearth and Hand use very neutral tones this season, so you know you could technically use this stuff year round. It doesn't just have to be for spring, but again, you can always add in your own pops of color if you would like. Um, so I'm just going to show you some of the throw pillows that they have, and then th I am going to be showing lumbar pillows, which are $29.99, not $19.99. So just to keep that in mind. Now moving along to the throw blankets, they are like a cottony linen material, so nothing fleece, so nice and light for the spring. They did have this navy blue and black pattern that was really pretty. They also had this yellow as well. I wanted to show you side by side. It doesn't match the golden throw pillow, so they are different shades of yellow. And then there are just a few other throws I wanted to show you as well. That is going to conclude today's video, my friends. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Again, I'll link as much as I can down below, but the items do not go live until December 26. If you enjoyed today's video and want to see more like it in the future, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.